able to see you next week because I'm going to Qatar. Hey, how was Dubai? I never said I was going to Dubai. I've noticed something really strange among a lot of the people in my network in different places around the world. See, I frequently travel to the Middle East Gulf and I often go to different countries. I've even lived for long periods of time in different countries in the Gulf. And I've noticed among my friends, even some highly educated people, that they seem to refer to the entire peninsula as Dubai. At one point, I was living in Saudi Arabia. In fact, I lived in Saudi Arabia for four years, which I think is long enough for anyone to figure out which country I'm actually in. But the conversation throughout those four years with many people around the world frequently went like this. So how's it going in Dubai? Um, I'm living in Saudi Arabia. It's a different country. And I never said I was living in Dubai. For many people around the world, it seems that either the whole Arab Gulf is called Dubai or it's the only name they associate with it. So today, I'm here to present you with a very simple and very important geography lesson about the Middle East Gulf. Geographically, the region includes many countries, but just for today, let's look at the GCC, or Gulf Cooperation Council, which is a political union of Saudi Arabia, Kuwait, Bahrain, Qatar, the UAE, and Oman. Dubai is just one part of the UAE, and it is an emirate. The UAE stands for United Arab Emirates. Then what is an emirate? An emirate is like a city-state, and there are seven emirates in the UAE. Dubai, Abu Dhabi, Sharjah, Ajman, Um Al Kawaim, Ras Al Haima, and Fujairah. Dubai is not a country. Every emirate is different, has different opportunities, and has a different feel to it. Of course, Dubai and Abu Dhabi are the two most famous emirates, but don't overlook the fact that there are five other emirates. And some emirates are hidden gems. I quite like visiting the emirate Ajman. It has beautiful beaches, wonderful all-inclusive resorts at half the price and without the bling bling of Dubai. To learn more about it, check out this video here. So the next time someone tells you that they're traveling to the Middle East Gulf, remember this little geography lesson and don't assume they are going to Dubai. There are many other beautiful places in the Middle East Gulf and every country deserves to be known. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Bye for now.